Hello and welcome to Glass Phoenix. I'm John Riska. Today we'll be talking about graphite marvers and molds and some of the things that we can do with them as glass workers. These first three are tools that I made myself. The front one is a push, the second is a flaring tool, and the third is a solid rod. I use these to manipulate the glass, particularly tubing, in a variety of ways. The two in the back are called marvers or paddles and the one that's in the front even has a couple of cups to help make marbles. Here's a torch mounted graphite marver. It's in an L shape. The nice thing about this is that while you're working, the flames actually heat up the graphite so that way when you're using the marver, it doesn't suck the heat out of the glass, which allows you to manipulate the glass far longer. This is a graphite pad that I use to roll the glass upon and if I need to smash it I can grab one of my marvers right above it. How do I get the glass so round? With graphite marble molds. Here we see marble molds from three inches in diameter all the way down to a quarter of an inch. And if you look closely here just on top there's one that's more cone shaped that helps with vortex marbles. Now here's me working on a one inch marble. When I first put the glass into the mold, I have to be very careful because the glass is so malleable that if I press too hard, I'll misshape the glass and it'll start to take on the ridges of the outside edge of the mold. But once I can get it in there and start rotating it, the glass will quickly start to take on the round shape. You might be asking yourself, why graphite? Isn't that the stuff that our pencil leads are made out of? And the answer is yes, it's just carbon. But the nice thing about that carbon is that unlike metal tools, which will get hot and trade electrons on the atomic level with the glass and therefore stick, carbon doesn't do that. I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Glass Phoenix Now. If you have, please subscribe. You can also find more about me and my work on Instagram, Etsy, and Twitter under Glass Phoenix Now, or you can follow me on Facebook under Glass Phoenix, John Riska II.